Johnny Perez is an instructor at a local jiu-jitsu academy called V-Pro-K. Like many of V-Pro-K's instructors, Johnny's very passionate and hardworking, but he also adds on something special to the class. The biggest thing he brings to the mat as an instructor is that he has this energy that it, it rubs off on other people. He's contagious with it, really. <laughs> Johnny's positive energy is spread through jokes and laughs. <laughs> you know, I always think he goes home and he sits down and he's like, what jokes am I going to say today? He's so he's coming up with new stuff. Johnny believes his talent for making people laugh is more important than just a simple good time. If there's a, a reason why I would say that I'm so joking is to promote a lot of smiles. There's a lot of depression, there's a lot of negativity in the world and you know, all it takes is one smile to change somebody's day, to change someone's life. Apart from his positive energy and his jokes, Johnny's very dedicated in improving his students' skills. He always wants to teach you, it's always fun. Um, I, I haven't reached a plateau yet, I mean, that with him, he always catches me on my bad things and makes me improve. But yeah, it's always getting better, it's always fun. But never enough that I can beat him, he always beats me, you know? Johnny is an inspiration story to many of his students. He suffers from a physical condition that affects one in a hundred thousand newborns. Still, Johnny hasn't let that stop him from doing what he loves. <laughs> What condition? Yeah, I have pollen syndrome is what it's called. There's, I have a, a missing left pectoral muscle and that. Johnny has found a way to work around his condition. He's been training jiu-jitsu for the past eight years and he doesn't plan to stop anytime soon. You know, I'm not gonna claim that I'm gonna be the next healer of Gracie, but I'm gonna be an old fart, still with, this, with the belts on, still on the mat, you know? The only thing that's gonna stop me is death, to death do us part. This is Daniel Segura from WFIU News.